match dimension attributes. This tool will allow us to go out there and select a dimension that has already been placed and use those attributes to place another dimension or possibly change an existing dimension attributes. To get to that tool, we'll go to your main modout toolbar. We'll go to your dimensioning tools. And if you hold your left mouse button down, the fifth option allows us to use the match dimension attributes. So I'll select it. Now whenever we come out here, we simply select the dimension that we want to match. And for this example here, I will match this dimension right here. That way it has the open arrowheads. We have text above and below the dimension line and so forth. So I'll go ahead and select it. And it matches those attributes of that dimension. So now if I come out here and use one of my dimensioning tools, which I'll go back to the main MoDOT toolbar, and maybe select my dimension linear, and I'll go out here and place a dimension, you'll see that those attributes are exactly the same as the one that you smart matched or matched earlier. That's what the match dimension attributes will allow you to do. Or, let's say you had an existing one out here and you want to change it. If I come out here and use my match dimension attributes, select the one that I want to match, which I'll just do the same one here. Now if I come back and use my change dimension in my dimensioning tools, and come out here and select one of these dimensions, which I'll just select this top one here, and then left click again to accept it, you'll see that it changed. The only thing that really changed on this one was the arrow hits because it was closed. Now they're open, so that's the only thing that really changed. But if you had other attributes for that dimension, they would have changed also. So that's the match dimension attributes tool and what it's used for.